Our bonding kit is one of our most popular items to assist in the bonding process. The bonding kit has quite a few things in it. The first thing is a sleeping bag. We've already learned that picking the hedgehog up out of the cage in the sleeping bag is much easier than trying to reach in. We've also seen how the hedgehog can sleep on your lap uh, in its sleeping bag directly from the cage. Once you're more comfortable um, picking the hedgehog up, letting it move around, the next bonding tool is the bonding bag. A lot of times hedgehogs, when they're crawling around on you, they'll aim for your armpit. Most of you, um, or many of you probably are familiar with that, that hide. So instead of the hedgehog hanging out on your armpit, which kind of reduces you, you can allow the hedgehog to sleep in the bonding kit um, while you go about your business. Even though you're not doing any work, actually touching it, handling it, or anything like that, you're still bonding. The bonding kit comes with two liners. The liners are these simple, simple bags. You want to turn the liners inside out. So the smooth side is where you're going to put your hedgehog. The reason for the liners is that sometimes the hedgehogs like to potty where they're sleeping. So you can simply exchange the liner instead of having a dirty bag. But as your hedgehog is in the bag, sleeping and resting and getting to know you, it's still hearing your heartbeat. It's getting to know your voice, getting to know your smell. And it's really an, a super important part of the bonding process. So just doing nothing with your hedgehog in the bag will increase your hedgehog's confidence in you that it's safe and secure. You can also put maybe a small toy, one of the fluffy pom-poms um, that has your scent on it down in the bag so it can curl up in the bag with your scent. Another, um, another item in the bonding kit is the tunnel. I like to call it the portable hoodie pocket because hedgehogs love hoodie pockets, but they are also um, prone to go potty in the pocket. So if you, once you gain confidence in handling your hedgehog, just allowing your hedgehog to sleep on your hand in the tunnel is another huge and valuable um, bonding process. Always check and look for loose threads like this. I don't know if you can see, because loose threads can wrap around feet they can rat and they can cause um, damage to their foot, even to the point that their foot may have to be amputated in a very short amount of time. So always look for loose threads, look for hairs, anything that could um, wrap around the hedgehog in the cage. When you're caring for your bonding kit, turn it inside out to make sure that there aren't any rips, tears. For example, here's a little hole that's developed. This would be very bad for the hedgehog to get stuck in. So always look for holes, rips, tears, anything like that to keep your hedgehog safe. I suggest washing the products inside out so that the, um, the part that's next to the hedgehog is the cleanest and, and gets cleaned thoroughly in the washer.